Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. I'm Burning Dog Face. And just in case you skipped the supplemental videos, and you really shouldn't, but just in case you did, uh, after the previous numbered video, I lost all of my progress and had to play through the entire game to get back to where I was. So now that I've finished retracing my steps, I just wanted it to be clear that things are more or less the same, but not exactly the same. Some armor bits I wore along the way that I was distinctly, uh, certain I had not worn the first time. Probably because I was more willing to experiment with, uh, upgrades early on. Ah, uh, here we are. <laughs> And if you did watch the, uh, the supplemental videos, well, then you're probably still haunted by the image of Kratos and Atreus' grinning faces. <laughs> so, uh, allow me to, at the very least, show you how I did that. I guess I was over there on the wall. Uh, let me just... I'm gonna stand right <gasps> here. Go to the options menu with Y. Go to photo mode. I have shown photo mode off with the filters and such, but uh, not this feature. Or, you know, for one thing, you can just hide. You know, so other characters show hide. This would be like if you wanted to get a cool action shot of Kratos in this exact pose, but, you know, he's swinging his axe. He's in that pose because he's swinging his axe into a dude. Uh, you can just hide all the monsters and focus on the cool pose. Or you can just pretend that Kratos is single again. Um, <laughs> but, more importantly, you can, in fact, change the facial expressions on Kratos and Atreus. <laughs> oh dear. They just all look strange, don't they, when it's not this. <laughs> I don't even want to know what you use this one for. Face 5, I'll come back to. Yeah, there's this fear look you don't really see on Kratos, uh, ever. Like, he didn't even look like that when Atreus was dying. He looked worried sick, but he did not look afraid. Yeah, there's an expression I would not expect to see on this man's face. See also, shock. Wait, is that the fucking... Is that the meme face? Is that... Oh, I don't, I don't even remember what it's called. Just suddenly got a vivid image of a specific gif. Oh! You know, I had wondered whether the tattoo was on his eyelids, and now I see that it is. Hot damn, man. That must have been brutal. And that's as far as it goes. You can just leave it on that expression of rage. Some of the ones on Atreus don't line up with the same numbers on Kratos. But, you know, they generally do. Ah, yes, this is phase five. Sorry, I have to go around Kratos, because it won't let me go through him. It's harder to tell on Kratos, but with the smirk and the raised eyebrow, I'm looking at this on, on Atreus and thinking, is that the goddamn DreamWorks face? Is that a joke? Oh. Uh, pardon me. I don't know how to make this work. Oop, almost had it there. I can't believe that actually worked. He does have a lot more facial scars than I would expect in a ten-year-old, even in this place. Modi commented on them when he was making fun of him. Your mama cut your face so you'd look as ugly as she does, and all that. They're blowing out his cheeks, I don't know what that's about. Yeah, Kratos does not do that one. Oh. Oh no, he has the same number. Which one was him blowing out his cheeks? I want to know that. Oops. 
twelve. Ah, ah, ah. No, he does not do the same thing. Oh, and for the record, you... Let me see. Oh, I know, the last one, or it's big and obvious. Yeah, there we go. Uh, yeah, for the record, the moment you back out... Oh, well, let me see. I'll put the camera over here first, and then... Uh, the moment you back out, they go back to their default facial expressions. You can't stick them that way to mess with the plot. Yeah, what I did, I just needed them both to be lined up with each other. So I jumped over here, and then took the picture while leaning out this way. Since their faces are right next to each other. But enough of this nonsense. We need to get the hell out of here. I've been in this room for far too long. Yes, Fafnir has been freed. Let me just take a look. Oh, all that, and I still missed one. Well, I don't need that. Oh. The barrel grew back. That's weird. Ah, oh, freedom! It is good to be back here with you guys. Obviously, the first thing I'm going to do is going to go get my armor upgraded. I've been saving up money and resources and... Well, actually, skill points for a while. But all that stuff. Um... Oh, yes, and also... Oh, no, the uh, the things go in here. That's right. All right, I'm not being attacked by Frost at this moment, so I'm going to go ahead and put on... Whoops. There it is, Mark of the Ranger. Which one is this? Oh, yes, lots of luck. I mean, I do a lot of throwing, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Oh, I saw some movement. I was like, uh? But no, it's just a frickin' bird who was spreading its wings. I don't remember if I did that test or not. Let's do that immediately. You know, before we head over there and say hi to Brock. Oh, boy. Oh, right. No shit, that doesn't work. That does! Hey! Brother, get up, brother. Oh, I used the stone in that fight freeing Fafnir, damn it. I was fighting two of those big champion guys. Uh, which ones? The... I thought I saw something odd in there. Uh, no. Oh, these guys! Uh, I think it was these guys. The glowing yellow ones, anyway. Okay, jar is still broken. Barrel is still back. I have no idea how this stuff works. Is it just the things without objects in them? Or without loot in them, I should say. I saw, I saw th 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 there, like that, the uh, the vines at the very top of the screen. And for like, I was like, is there a nightmare just chilling up there? Oh! Oh, geez, so many things I need to do all, all at the same goddamn time. Like, for example, no, no, getting confused here. Here we go. Oh, I never upgraded that one at all. Embarrassing. I just thought that I should earn that uh, achievement they gave me when things were getting fucky. So let's fully upgrade the River of Knives, since I really like that attack. Launches well, two additional lines of ice shards, greatly increasing the width of the attack. Boop. Oh, achievement unlocked. The best moves. Fully upgrade a runic attack. <laughs> I don't know why I made it like that. That was weird. Oh, yes, and uh, this one, the super attack one. Uh, I really liked the sound of that until I realized I was on the heavy runic attack screen. That would actually be pretty good as a light attack. 
And I do like that. So let's just make it hurt more. Further increases... Oh. The, the duration of the lingering spin. It, I guess I did upgrade that one. I thought it said one when I looked at it, but whatever. Perhaps I went insane. Um, greatly increases the duration of the lingering spin attack. Further increases the duration of the lingering spin attack and causes a massive explosion in the follow-up uh, slam. Whoa! It even looks more dangerous. Okay, the front. Sorry about that. The uh, the program stopped recording, and now it's doing that thing where the uh, the controls aren't properly responding. This is actually the second time it's happened here uh, today since I had to abandon an, uh, an attempt at the intro to the video. So I'm just gonna go ahead and reboot and hope for the best. See you in a moment on the other side of this elevator sequence. Oh yeah, that room where I freed Fafnir is called the Council of Valkyries, which I find very odd. Or this area, I should say. Yeah, sometimes when I... The reason this is really bad is because sometimes I press the button and nothing happens because it suddenly switched to keyboard controls. Like, right there, I pressed A, and I had to press it a second time to get this to come up. Did it there, too, with confirming. So yes, I'll see you on the other side of this jump cut. Okay, I'm starting to hate this place, kind of, because, uh, I didn't have any trouble at all in, uh, Fafnir's room filming that whole, you know, uh, vacation slides video in many pieces. Even when I was going back and forth between God of War and the, uh, the editing window to make sure I got everything right. Let's get away from this place and see if that helps. Oh yes, and there was a chest I wanted to open in there. Yeah, I think that's the vault we're going for. I don't know why these things have such... so few, uh... Docking spots. The chest I mentioned is exactly where I would expect another one was. I believe this is where we were walking and Freya was providing uh, exposition for what the temple is. Dum to dum dum dum. I did start the timer, yes? Yes, good. There it is. But what is that? Texture of the stone right there, but <laughs> weightless war handles, rare blades pommel. Okay. Which one's rising fury? Well, I can check real, real quick. Uh, Rising Chaos, Bloom of Chaos, Whirling Chaos, Rising Fury. It's the, yeah, the heart attack. Sure. I got a bunch of stuff. Oh, I don't have that. Okay. 
think I've got everything here except the upgrades for the uh, the multiple target thing, which did not at all do what I wanted it to do, and for the alternate stance stuff, which I'm having trouble even visualizing before I get. Just pausing momentarily after any attack. It would help if you was actually, you know, standing in a different stance. In that little preview there. I forgot if that was even an option. I don't think I ever did that. That's an equivalent of, uh, this ability. Oh, and not to tempt fate, but when everything crashed uh, just earlier, uh, I was starting to say that the frost from, uh... I can't remember what it's called. From this... That was weird. Didn't like the hitch there. Yeah, the frost there was sticking out over the edge of the beach and clearly floating on top of the water. What the part of the... What the axe even is that? Oh, okay. Forgot about the little crown-looking thing on the end. That means it was stuck handle first into the ground. That's weird. Let's just keep going around so we can say that we can't ha that we have, yes. Well, I guess this isn't exactly where we went, because if it was, we would be able to see uh the giant thing Kratos is pushing around. Oh, yes. I have recalled. Storm of the Elks. Let's give this a shot. Don't just wait on the stairs, my boy. Okay. Nice! And it didn't even hurt that frog. And that was level one. Let me guess, bum fuzzled. What's got you all bum fuzzled over there? Get going! God damn it, Brock. Oh, I've noticed, in addition to like some of the treasures we've been finding popping up here and there, uh... I'm pretty sure this is the, uh, the Muspelheim, uh, cipher. I don't know why it's on display in here, but there it is. I'm just gonna pause it so he doesn't say that line again. I wanted to give a shout-out. Yeah, here it is. Uh, shout-out to Torek00, a comment that I got just today on the subject of uh, the boss fight against Magni and Modi. You know, I think it's BECAUSE the violence of this god-slaying is so subdued compared to Kratos' Greek escapades, but it's actually pretty disturbing to see Kratos hack at a man like he's the tree at the start of the game. It's that Leviathan stops completely, and Kratos has to yank it back out. It's mundanely visceral. I like that a lot. That's a very good point. Let's get to it! Okay, first things first. I don't even know if this is going to be any good anymore, but I really, really wanted to make the Pauldron of the Ancients, since I apparently have three ancient hearts. I don't think I attacked any that I didn't attack the first time, although it did mean that getting the ones I got the first time meant I had to deliberately antagonize them instead of doing it by accident, like I did back then. Also, this does say it's worse up in the corner, but this is the level 1 version. Or the unupgraded version, I should say. Resistance to all elemental damage. Oopsie! boy. That is no subtitle. What did he say?
And waste armor. Uh, I do remember getting this one just before. But there was also a belt of the ancients, and I think I have a quest to make... Hmm, let me find out. Now about that other thing. Oh, the Andvare thing, yes. I think I found a suggestion this time around that Andvare was the one who cursed uh, Fafnir. So that was uh, interesting. Look at the fucking rocks on his shoulder. Hell yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, go ahead and... Oh, wait. Uh... It was this one. Okay, that is the one I wanted, so I'm glad that happened. Ooh, back down to level four. Let's see if we can't fix that right after I check my goals. Uh... Oh, kill all the ancients. Great. Huh? So was it just, like, the first piece, or...? What, the full set, or...? No, it just says completed. Bring the ancient heart back. Uh, I guess, okay, fine, yeah, I guess the, that is just the quest. I must have been thinking of this one. That's just for experience. So I guess I don't need to make the others. Let's see how this does sure, when I upgrade it. Fuck. I did not think about that. God damn it, of course it requires that. Alright, I don't love that. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, it looks baller. I don't know that it looks like something I want to put on Kratos. I suppose that is better. And it does have two enchantment sockets. Oh, well. Tell you what. I'll just go back with the other armor I had. And I'll put this on, because I know it'll be uh, way better than what I've got. Once I uh, give it an upgrade or two. You gotta keep on protecting bits off you. And then we'll see if I can't fix that. Hey! And that will fix things. I'm sure that'll keep you out of trouble. Oh no, it doesn't fix things because I've still got the other one on. But that's okay. I need more uh, stuff to fix that. Oh right, I didn't actually look into that, but... Uh... Okay. Now there's something else. He just can't remember for the life of him. Oh, there they are. Uh, deadly war handles. All right, fine. They do look nice, after all. I guess I'll just put the other one back on. Alas, alas. Oh, wait, 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 that's right. Uh, and then the other one can be... Can't for the life of me remember what it was. that. Sure. Sure. I don't know, man. Oh, I think that was uh, like one of the defensive ones, like Frost or Fire or something. Was that the one I had the other thing on? Ah, uh, it's confusing. This one also has a second slot. No. No. Right. I forgot to get to push a different button there. How embarrassing! 
Um. Uh, okay, now we're just down here. I mean, that is an appropriate name. Sure. Let's throw that on there for now. Until I come up against something elemental, I guess. Oh, good. There that is. Excellent! Well, at least I have my nice pants. We gotta get those ogre uh, shirts later. I can fix that. Oh yeah, I realized this time that there's just places I didn't go. Like, oh, this is just the side of the lake. I just didn't go here. I don't recognize this area. And uh, one of them was right there. It's just boat over there. Though the actual boating part... We'll have to wait. Because all this uh, catching up has... You know? I do want to know what happens there. I can end the video that way. There we go. This video has uh, brought us to the end of the time. So I'm just going to go ahead and run up. I don't know that this is a great idea. I don't think we should disturb Yomangandar without some reason. Oh, that's no fun. <laughs> I mean, he's right. I basically did just say that. But, uh, yeah. So let me just... Is it on that side, then? Atreus, to me! I thought it was on this okay, side. I'm coming! Oh well, let's be over here. We're going to the big statue of the rowing guys. I noticed an alcove in there, like a beach right next to it. I don't think I went to. That's probably where I'm going to find the, uh... That one treasure map I found this time. Oh yeah, speaking of things I don't have, uh... Let's see. I am... There they are. Yes, I'm one raven short, but I know for a fact I didn't get the one next to the elevator, the Valkyrie elevator in Helheim, because I haven't gone back there with Atreus yet. So, you know, it's, it's, it's nice that I know that. I also don't know for sure that I got the same 26 ones. I consciously skipped the first couple of uh, ravens, because I knew I hadn't gotten those the first time, because I didn't know why I needed to attack them at that point. Um... Oh, yes, and I uh, still have a couple of treasure maps that I got the first time. I just forgot to do this one when I was over there. Uh, yeah, that one I just haven't gotten back to do. But yeah, we're going for this next time. On hand level with the oarsmen. All right, I'm Burning Dogface, and I will see you next time on Let's Play God of War. Until then, have a great day. Later!